and action! Welcome to our Ottolenghi test kitchen and welcome to the Bailey's cake that Jens is going to show you how to make. Uh, yeah, uh, I hope you enjoy it. It's fun. It's one of the best cake we have and it's super delicious and not that difficult to make. Okay, thanks Jotam. Um, yes, I got my friend Conrad with me today. He has absolutely no idea about baking. And I'm going to show you how to make the chocolate Guinness cake out of the book Sweet. And yeah, let's have a look if he is able to do it. Enjoy. Preheat the oven to 190 degrees. After that, we line our little tins um, with parchment paper and just allow it to slightly come over the edges. It's just easier to lift out at the end. Place the Guinness and the butter in a saucepan on medium heat until the butter melts. Uh, do not boil it. And then we're going to add our cocoa powder and sugar and mix it. In a separate bowl, we mix together sour cream, eggs, and vanilla extract. Then we add this into the Guinness mixture and whisk it as we do so. Conrad sifts flour, salt, and baking soda together in a bowl. Then whisk it into the mixture until combined and smooth. Okay, then we pour the cake butter into the tins and bake it for around about 20 minutes. Or until we take a cake skewer, insert it in the center of the cake and it comes out clean. Let's do the Baileys cream. To make it, we whisk together Baileys, mascarpone and icing sugar to a thickish consistency. Transfer it to a piping bag and keep it in the fridge just until later. Chocolate ganache in three simple steps. Step number one, blend your chocolate until it's fine. Second step, heat up sour cream and golden syrup. When bubbles appear, pour over the chocolate and mix it until it's combined. Third step, Conrad adds the butter and continues to stir until it's smooth and shiny. After that we set it aside and just let it cool down a little bit. When the cakes are cold, make a 3 cm cut down the middle and just fill it with Bailey's cream. After we filled the cakes, we take them out of the tin and cover the top with ganache. And the very last step, we cover our little cakes with the chocolate shavings.
Welcome to the end of the video and here they are, the chocolate Guinness cake with Bailey's cream on the inside. Comrade did an amazing job, how was it for you? I'd love to help you Jens, I was surprised how easy the recipe was and um, yeah, I'm waiting to eat them. Yes, now we're going to taste them and well, see you in the next one. Thanks for watching, tschüss! tschüss.